Hey there, my name is Neil from Flowcharts team. In this video, I'm going to cover two things. One is what is Flowcharts and how it can benefit you. And number two, how quick and simple and easy it is to get set up. With our system, it enables you to create your first flowchart, workflow, questionnaire, survey, or form, and it's dynamic. So depending on how your user interacts with the form, it will present them with the different questions. So you can steer and navigate them down the path that you want them to, okay? Uh, unlike other systems or forms, they're all static and linear. So we're uh, unique in the fact that we're using AI to predict how your respondent is answering your questions. So this opens up a lot of applications for flowcharts. It could help you diagnose a problem. It could be used to collect information before making decisions. You could provide price quotes and estimates to your leads and customers. Uh, you can do evaluations, orders, you name it, okay? And so the benefit, obviously, is that it's going to reduce uh, survey fatigue, it's going to respect your respondents' time, and it helps your business get better, better data and make decisions faster, okay? So let's now dive into how to set up your first uh, flowchart. Again, it's very quick and easy. So when you set up your trial account, you'll be given a demo. Uh, it's called Examples. So let's click on that. And for the purposes of this demonstration, you, uh, we want to see how a customer's experience was at our business. So uh, we want to find out if they had a great experience. And if they did, we want them to go and promote our business by leaving us a review on Google, Facebook, Yelp. And if they did not have a good experience, well, we don't want them to do that. But we want to hear what their input and feedback um, is so that we can improve our business. It also enables us to intercept them from having to go and leave a bad review, right? So let's get started. Uh, the first leading question is, did you have a great experience in your business today? And this is going to be our start question. It's going to be, a, and the question type is going to be yes or no. Okay. The system also allows you to pick from free response, a single choice. They can only pick one answer choice from the multiple choices, or they can pick multiple uh, choices from the multiple choices, right? So that, and they, you're able to do that. Now, if they answer yes, well, we want them to come down to this box. We're glad that you had a great experience. Can you please support us by leaving us a review? Well, if they say no, well, we want them to come down this path. What could we have done to improve your experience? Okay. So what we do is we draw arrows between the two, and we have conditions set up. So this is a condition. If they answer yes, it's going to come down this path. And if they answer no, well, it's going to come down this path. Okay, so as you can see, we have this flowchart set up, and depending on how your user responds to the questions, it will dynamically change. So you can steer and guide your user in the path that you want them to to help you get better data, right? So once you're all ready to go, you can launch this form or this workflow. You click on Share. You can do it inside this app, or you can uh, do it through the um, Apple or Android application. So in this case, we'll go ahead and launch this in our iOS application. So we can give the the iPad or the kiosk or the uh, phone to the uh, end user. Click on the form here and what it's going to do is going to ask them for to fill out the form. So we'll put in John Doe. Did you have a great experience at your business today? And if they say yes, it's going to come here, right? If they say no, it's going to come here. So let's say yes. Since we said yes, it's going to come down to this box. You are the best. Where would you like to leave us a review? Okay. And then it will allow us to pick from Google, Facebook, Yelp, or TripAdvisor. You obviously can come in here and change the links as you see fit. But again, this is all a demo. So let's go ahead and click on Google. Yes, I left the review. Okay, and submitted. So now we can come back into the view responses and see that this user has filled it out. This is the responses to the questions, okay? Also gives us a chance to have narratives filled out. So if we wanna have it in a paragraph form, we can do that as well. So for example, if you say, did you have a great experience at our business today? We can come in here and say, the customer had a great experience today, right? Or, for example, what could we have done to improve us or uh, your experience? The customer recommends we do the following, and you can say, 
click this button, value, okay, and if depending on what they type in, it gets put into that into a paragraph form, right? So this just shows you how you can use flowcharts to your advantage, all right? Now to get started with your own, obviously you're going to just click on this box container to create your first box. You say question A, start question, and then you could have a free response, yes or no, single choice, multiple choice. Then you can draw another box and then draw arrows between them. Okay. And you can have select the conditions that you want. So for example, if you say, you know, what color, what fruit do you like most? And then let's give them some options like apples, pears, watermelon, grapes, okay. So here we can select from the different options. To so say apples, we can say, well, what kind of apples do you like? Right? And if they pick watermelon, well, we can have what kind of watermelon they like here. So that gives you an idea of how you can use the software to help gather more data and improve your business analytics. If you have any questions, please reach out to us. We're always here to help you out. Thank you so much.